but anyway, let's start. And it seems like it, I can play it with controller, so that's nice. Sea of Stars has two main characters. Select the one who will lead the party. This can be changed later and does not affect the story. Valerie and Zale, a monk born on the winter solstice, walks the path of the guardian goddess Luana. A blade dancer born on the summer solstice walks the path of the guardian god Solen. Let's go with the Zael for now. Great archives. Oh man, I love this classic feeling. Welcome to the Great Archives adventure. I suppose curiosity brought you here. An important trait to be sure. I am the archivist, an immortal versed in the ways of alchemy. But perhaps you knew that already. Um, after spending millennia cataloging the many events of Kaut countless timelines, I decided to return here to mull over everything I had seen. In my musings about the stories that fill these books and scrolls, I had a recent epiphany. It seems that in my haste, I may have overlooked the very thing I was hoping to find. And what's that? At such, there is one special story I wish to revisit, one deserving of a witness. And should the mist of time allow a sight, slight alteration, I believe the ray of hope that was once offered may yet bloom. Alright. So walk with me tonight and we will explore a tale of high adventure of magic and deceit, of friendship and wonder, but mostly a tale of heroism, one that I believe will offer valuable insight in the search for a resolution to the throes of the Fleshmancer. Okay. Now I remain a bit lost amidst all these timelines and all their subtle variations, but I know just the one to make for a perfect starting point. All right. Let us see what we find in there. Ah yes, our story begins in a world visited by the flesh monster generations prior, causing much turmoil and leaving a mark that has yet to be fully cleansed. Somewhere on Evermist Iceland, two brave children of the Solestis are on their way to meet with immortal spirit. In order to become fully fledged Solestis warriors, they will need to learn how to use magic Use magic without using magic. Wow, okay. Use magic without using magic. Okay. That's interesting. Mountain trail. Alright, we made it to the mountain trail. So far, so good. So the elder myths live somewhere here, huh? Do you think it's just another test? Could be, but it's sure bit sitting the academy, sitting at the academy, and suing. <laughs> yeah, I'm so glad that's over with. Okay. Uh, I wanna. It's annoying the the text the the text sound. You know, I wanna disable it. Let's see if they have an option. Apply yourselves for the will you weave into it shall be your sole defense in times of greater needs. While the lessons taught here may appear to be lost on you, some something deep inside is compelled to learn. Okay. Seems like they're having fun. Hey, the sun will be setting soon. We should prepare to set up camp. Let's split up and search for a good spot. Okay. Time for some scouting. I'm coming through. Okay, first battle directly, huh? Uh, attack. Okay. Wanderer. Bam. Wonderable nine. Okay. Okay, so he's gone. All right. Burga. 
Brugavs wasn't kidding. This feel easier to fight or this feels easy. Let's see where this leads. Okay. All right. Uh, dialogue loop volume, right? I don't want that. Yeah, I think other things are okay. What's the pixel perfect? I really don't know. What does pixel perfect do? Let's try it and see. Okay, let me... Let me just go with default for now. Not sure what it does, but... Traversal, movement, LS to run around, climbing, while facing a climb stone, press A to snap on, up and down, hosting, while facing a ledge of one or two units above, press A to, okay, press A to jump down, okay, I see, combat, general, combat initiate when your party leader collides with an enemy, turn base, okay, Timing hits, your attacks and skill can be enhanced by pressing A at the right time to increase damage. Healing or scare additional hits. Timing your hit is not mandatory, just think of it as a bonus. Timing blocks, enemy attacks and skill can be mitigated by pressing A at the right time to reduce their damage. Timing your blocks is not mandatory, okay. Skills, skills are special actions that cost MP, okay. MP regeneration. Regular attack recover 3 MP. Alright, I see. Items. Uh, breaking locks. Okay. Enemies mounting special attacks will display a bar with locks. Deal damage of the relevant type to break these locks and weaken the enemy's action. I see. Combos. The dual attack. Swapping characters. Okay, I can cycle through the characters. Alright. Survival Max HP plus 100% and auto heal after comeback uh, Maybe not Okay, we'll, we'll, we'll find out as we go on Okay, let's go check here Wow. Let's go. So he's mounting special attack. Bam. Oh, wow, 18. Tough one, huh? Let's try this. Sunball. Solar magic projectiles that splashes to nearby target. Let's do that. Hold A for power. Nice. Found anything? Just a dead end. How about you? Nothing of note, but the way to the top is definitely through here. The sun is setting. Come over. I'll get the fire going. I'll be right there. Can't wait for more tomato clubs. Okay? Fine. Press A to unroll rope ladders. Okay. Okay. Nice. Can I go there? I guess not. Let's go up. I guess there is no map, huh? I have the MP, right? Healing light. Yeah, I have the MP, right? Blazing Sword! Bam! I love it. 
Jump, 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 jump. Come on. You wanna go? Ha, ah, but it doesn't beat the face you made the first time you tried smashing a shin ball. Oh, I can still hear the headmaster gloating. As I said, whether by paying attention in class or by recklessly attempting to hit a projectile with your open palm, you will learn the first rule of solar magic. <laughs> okay. I guess he's quoting his master. To be fair, you did learn. Oh yeah, that one only took once. You ever miss those years? Before training, just being kids are always daydreaming and getting in trouble. And making mistakes. I'm s okay, what kind of mistakes he did make? I'm, I don't know. It's okay, I understand why he w wouldn't want to join us after what happened. It's okay, I guess they're talking about some, some of their old colleague. Hmm. I wish he had said goodbye, you know. After 10 years of not seeing his face, just to know that he's alright. And that we are still friends, okay? Why did we have to get ahead of ourselves anyway? Gal. Okay, so they're talking about someone named Gal. Okay, so we are going a flashback, huh? In the village of Moon Cradle. So that's Gale, huh? My weapon will be something that hits really hard. And I'll pick a fast one. Garl will be unstoppable. Okay. Imagine all the wonders we'll find after we leave Evermist Island. I want to see the sleeper. What's that? You never heard of the sleeper? Stories say it's a giant serpent and it's been sleeping curled up around a mountain since even before there were traveling historians to record it. Okay. No way. Sure is, and it's super dangerous too. But don't worry, it can't wake up. Why not? Apparently there is holes in the mountains and the wind blows through them and that plays a melody that keeps it asleep. I want to see it too, okay? What's that? It's the bell, Erlina and Brugaves are back, okay? Quick, maybe we can catch them before they get to the academy. Okay, what's this? I guess I can save it? Ah, I see. Children of the Solistis. Moon Cradle. And what's here? I guess I can't open those, huh? Let's go. Hey there, younglings. Are you still playing in that little cave down below? Okay, so that's just a villager, huh? Okay, we're going here. The crops are our main source of food. It's hard work, but I am reminded every day when we eat all it together that effort is well worth it, okay? You keep on doing it, buddy. Uh, what's here? I hope you are not getting into trouble again. Oh, we sure are. This is the backstory after all. Ah. Nothing here. So we gotta go that way. Hey, wait. Oh, wow. There you are, Brugaves. Playing in your secret hideout again. 
we were training, I think I can use magic now. Is that so? Let's see it then. Oh wow. Come closer, Zell. Open your palm and concentrate. <laughs> sure you are. <laughs> exactly. Come here then. Oh, easy now. I can't report to the headmaster if you knock me out. Okay. You did it. Solustice Warriors. Headmaster Moraine, if you are done with your babysitting duties, I would hear your report. Right away, Headmaster. Can we go to? Believe me, once you enter Zenith Academy, you'll wish you hadn't. Okay, so this is a magic academy. Let's go, Brugraves. The full moon is out. Okay. He's right. Want to go to the forbidden heaven again? We tried already, I can't open it. Yeah, but last time we decided maybe the full moon couldn't make the rune more sensitive. I'm sorry it will work and Moraine will be so impressed. He'll take you to info training right away and then we'll finally be allowed to leave this island. What if he gets mad and delays our training instead? Well, we can worry about that after I... Okay, uh, of course. I mean, if I open it. Alright, let's go. So we are going back. What's here? Okay. This seems like a teleportation kind of thing. I don't know. Anyway, let's check here. Who is this? I know you wanted to catch Arlena and Brugaves, but it's starting to be late. Bedtime soon, okay? Alright. So I guess we sleep here. And what's here? So this is just the backyard, huh? Okay, I guess we go back from there. Alright. So who's this? Remember, young ones, the Celestial Willow was a gift from the Great Eagle. Always treat it with respect. Celestial Willow. This one. Okay. Okay, so there is nothing here, huh? Okay. Where would the Forbidden Cave be? Okay, there is nothing there. Let's try to go up here. Okay, I guess we do need to go there. Ah, that is the Forbidden Cavern. And this is what? Moon Cradle. Okay, I see. So let's go to the Forbidden Cavern, I guess. Let's save it. We made it. Time to stop for a <laughs> Sure. Yeah, we just left a few minutes ago. Look, it's not a real adventure if you don't eat a snack on the road. Plus, I made something special for the occasion. Here. Nice. Sandwich? Oh, that's really good, huh? It's the jam I used a bit of sap from the celestial willow. Okay. You could get in trouble for that. Only if you tell. Oh, I'm sure it's gonna fuck them somehow. How do I open this? Maybe like Arlena showed me? Try opening your palm and concentrating. Alright. Uh 
And I'm sure it has nothing to do with the celestial willow. <laughs> the headmaster must have heard the bell ring. Did we just wait for do we just wait for him to show up? Might as well enter. It can be our first adventure. Yeah, and then the headmaster will know we are not afraid. Of course you are not. Let's go. Oh wow. There's monster over there. Let's hide. Okay. I thought ever Mist Iceland was safe. Guess that's only true for Moon Cradle. We should go back, they look dangerous. Yeah, good call. Oh wow, of course. Maybe try to use your powers? We are not ready for this. I don't know, just try. <laughs> oh wow. His eye? Okay. Wow. I. Okay. The headmaster, right? As resourceful as you are, reckless, I see. Headmaster Gal needs help. It feels better. Like anyone born in Moon Cradle, a regular kid, what Gal needs is not to concern himself with the affairs of the Solstice Warrior. Okay, so he's a regular kid, they are saying. Okay. I'm really sorry, Headmaster, it was all my idea. Be thankful that. The only cost of this lesson was an eye, young lad. All right. I mean, losing an eye is a big deal, man. Make sure to treat the wound and soothe the poor kid. He's not the complaining type, but if the pain seems to return, please send for me. Understood, Headmaster. You will not see your friend for a very long time. If you have any parting words, speak them now. Can't he come and stay with us? How long is very long? Like a week? Ah, the eagerness of youth. <laughs> it takes years to properly train Solistis what? Years? No way. Your friends have much to learn. I would suggest you use that time to reflect upon what happened today. With any luck, it will help you forget any ideas of getting involved with a burden that is not yours to bear. Okay? Don't forget about me. Never. We'll train really hard. Maybe it won't take so long. Alright? It is a teleportation device. Oh, it's just a flying disc. <laughs> Elevator, huh? Welcome to Zenith Academy. In this ancient place of knowledge, you will learn everything you need to know in order to become true Celestis Warriors. We've been waiting for this so long. When do we start? Tomorrow, though, I believe a proper introduction is in order. Careful now. Somebody's gonna jump in. Level 2, I guess. A 
level 3. You just just pop up the sky, huh? Basically. Welcome to the classroom in the sky. Okay, what kind of resonance? Good on you for noticing that. Getting closer to the stars helps new recruits get acquainted with their innate magic. It shows great promise that you were able to feel it before and Zell too from what Arena told me. Oh, it was just a small burst. They have no idea how much... Okay. Now in the many years you will spend at Zenith Academy, you will learn about the duties incumbent upon Solastri Swire, of the magic you are destined to wield and the evils that... Okay. We'll learn how to fight too, right? Naturally. You will spend your days training and studying, but most importantly, suing. <laughs> that sounds boring. It is. A mandatory task nonetheless. All who would join our orders begin by weaving their will into an enchanted piece of fabric, the staple of the Celestist Warrior. It is their most prized possession, guaranteeing light in the darkness darkest places and a measure of protection against the minions of the flesh mancher i guess this flesh mancher guy is the boss or whatever but first you must learn of your duties train until you cannot feel your limbs and then train some more once both your body and mind are ripe with potential you will create a magic piece of fabric worthy of the very stars you will then be sent out beyond the forbidden cave to meet with the elder mist for it alone may officially grant the title of Solastis Warrior. I understand it is not what you were hoping for, but it is what it is. Alright, fine. Years of suing. That will be all. Alright. Okay, let's make ourselves home. To the left is the training room. You are to go there first thing in the morning. Above is the way to my chambers. Uh, it is off limits, of course. And to your right are the dormitory. Okay. Feel free to look around and then go to sleep when you are ready. Good night. Okay. So this side is the training. So this is the training room, huh? Alright. Let's check it out. Who's this? Moraine finally decided that we are ready. Okay. Uh, we can go up. Oh, we can. I guess that's all. Alright. And then we have the headmaster's bed chamber. Here. And it's a big key. Basically. Let's talk to him. I remember when early nine burgers were your age, they wouldn't stop running. I feel old now. <laughs> Alright. Go here. Stay point? Yeah, okay. The school in the sky. Okay. Okay, this one. What? How many beds are for you, man? This side? Sure. Let's do that. Good morning, fellas. Bergawes. So you'll be our trainer? I wish. Early and I are leaving tomorrow, but the headmaster was kind enough to let us make your first day special. Are you ready for training? You bet. That's what I like to hear. I reckon this should be well suited for the two of you. Okay, training sword. Training staff, okay. Got to work. No, oh, they're just running. Okay. <laughs> All right. 
Oh wow. She pick up the pace, huh? Yeah, yeah. Why don't you train by running up and down on ladder? <laughs> All right. Feel free to take a break. Alina will see you on the terrace whenever you are ready. All right. So let's go on to the terrace, I guess. Okay, just outside the academy entrance. All right. I gotta go out. So there you are, ready to learn magic. It should feel as if something was scratching and each far away from you. You must focus on the sensation and compel it to come closer. All right. I almost had it. Now mine's gone too. Just breathe slowly. Okay. If your timing is true, it will manifest. On three, one, two, three. <laughs> okay. I'm sure your training will go well, but one more thing, no matter what the headmaster teaches you, remember that this is your life and <laughs> since you are done onboarding our new recruits in the ways of magic, I would provide the briefing for your next assignment. All right, send her away, huh? As for the two of you, it is about time you tried that sewing kid. Move along now, all right? Making a magic piece of fabric worthy of the very stars sure is a tall order. What shape to even make? At least the headmaster said we wouldn't get it right the first time. Okay. <laughs> You're bored? So what do you want to do? Go to sleep? I guess not. Anything? Let's save it. I guess nothing here, huh? Let's go out and check. You keep saying that, but the flesh monster left our realm for good when the Dweller of strife was destroyed, so why can't they have a normal life? And you know the three of us can take on Take the one on Wraith Iceland. We don't need them Prudence Erlina, there is no telling what threats we may face in the future uh, Zale and Vedri were brought to the moon cradle by the great eagle It is not the place of the headmaster to question such things and neither it is yours so how much is enough? What about Moyora? What about the twins? Brugaves. Do not judge a sacrifice you cannot begin to comprehend. Alright. This conversation is over. They will study here while you carry on with your investigation. On the first eclipse after their training is complete, they will join us for the cleansing. Learn as much as you can until then. Let's just go Brugaves. Alrighty. <laughs> Focus and then release. 
that's a montage I guess and the longer a dweller is left to its devices the stronger it gets this makes patrol duty essential let one grow too long and you have a world eater on your hands against such a foe even a legion of solstice warrior would be helpless since delaying only increases the chances of a world eater cleansing always targets the strongest dweller known to us if dwellers are immune to our magic how can we fight them uh, that is why cleansings are always performed during total eclipse in these moments only the dwellers weaknesses are exposed how many dwellers are left just one known as the dweller of woe but we cannot know for sure the flesh mancher just may have planted other seeds of evil before leaving our world thus we must always remain vigilant okay dweller of strife and who is moyora that will be all for today <laughs> all right okay what is it i think i heard a voice coming from the entrance what time is it who cares let's go check it out all right That's closed. The entrance is here, right? So let's just go. Hey, look. Dear Zell and Valerie. Oh, Gal. If you're reading this, it probably means I got caught. I'm writing this as a failsafe, but I hope to see you in person. I made cookies filled with celestial willow jam you liked. I'm doing everything I can to be ready to leave when you graduate. In the meantime, I hope your training is going well. Oops, now the platform is almost up and I can see Moren is there waiting for me. He looks very angry. I will try to drop the jar without him noticing. I guess that means I won't be able to try a visit again, but thinking of you every day and can't wait. I hope you like the cookies. Your friend until the end of time. God. Okay. Okay. Eat, eat the cookie jar. Okay. Where do we want to eat it? Okay. These cookies are amazing. I can't believe Gar was just there. Okay. It will happen. We just have to keep on training hard. Okay. Just eat your cookies, man. And so they trained and they sued for years. Okay. And then they trained and they sued some more. Oh, wow. Until one day. Finished. Zell, that's the one. I can feel it too. Hold on. Alright, I think I got it too. Let's go see Headmaster. Alright, so they got the... They cut the cloth. Heroes in the making, huh? Alright. Anything on that side? Ah, the lady. Let's go.
Headmaster, we think we are ready. Why yes, the tingling of magic in the air has been building up for a few weeks now. Congratulations, moving forward there will be no more suing. I can deal with that. It will soon be the time for you to live on your journey to meet the Elder Mist. But before we get to that, Zenith Academy has one more challenge for you. Visitor arrived, perfect timing. Who's the visitor? Ah. Good to see you. Review the basics of combat. Okay. Check in with them and they do time for your final test. Sure. Want to review the combat basics? Sure, let's do that. Let's get started. Just attack me now in any order. Okay. When all of your party members... Okay. Okay, so I can change using this. Let's use this. Bam. Good. Focus is paramount whenever you perform attacks and skills. With the proper timing, you can increase the damage that you deal and sometimes even score it. Let's see it. Press A as the hit connects to increase damage. Ah, missed it. Nice, okay. Let's see that one more time. Nice. So when I press it, when it hits. Alright, so don't worry about it too much. Just keep on trying and your sense for it will develop over time. Okay, now for timing your blocks. Let's get the little guy in here. To be efficient in battle, you must pay attention to anything that starts moving. With proper timing, you can reduce the damage. Okay. Okay, I missed that. That was also too soon. Ah. Okay. Okay, I see. No one is expected to block everything. On it's about time getting it perfect. Okay. Growing sense of it. Alright. Oh wow! When a party members get knocked out in battle, you'll need to switch more defensive mode. Chaos allies will get back up on and down at 50% HP once all chaos stars are gone. One chaos star is removed at the end of each round. The more you fall during the same battle, the more chaos stars there are. So be careful. If all party members go down, it's game over. Fight and survive until Valerie returns. Okay. Okay, I missed it. Okay, I blocked that. And there you have it. Good work today. I'm sure the exam will be a breeze. Alright. Basics of magic? Sure, let's do that. When enemies prepare spells, you must do everything you can to prevent them. If you follow your senses, you can try dealing damage of the types that will break their concentration. Alright, simpler spells will only demand normal attacks. Valry, can you do blunt damage and Zale has slicing? Valry can do blunt damage and Zale has slicing. Let's see you break this one. Okay, so she needs uh, blunt, blunt and slice slice okay all 
Okay, I see. I see. Just like that. Now some spells will also demand magic damage to break. You can control your projectiles now. So let's give it a shot. Zale for sun and Valerie for moon. Okay. So sun and moon, huh? So he can do sun. And she can do moon. Moon rank. Lunar magic potential that can bounce to multiple targets. And this one is... Okay. I see. I see. <laughs> well done. Now you can sense your MP is a bit low, right? To keep up the pace in the battle, you must remember to regenerate MP. Hit me with a normal attack. So the normal attack regenerate. You just got some MP back by attacking. You must face your spells with normal attack to avoid ending up. Okay, I see. You should not hesitate to use spells when MP abounds. For a regular attack on a full bar is a waste of regeneration. The key is to experiment. Keep on varying your actions and find the rhythm. Okay. All battle actions, lock breaking, especially build your combo energy. When you have enough, you can spend combo points to perform powerful action. Combos cost no MP and are lost after battle. Okay, so you use them. Okay, so I can do a combo. Solesty strike, blunt and slicing, huh? Dual attack, each regenerate 3 MP. Ah, I see. Keep an eye out in your adventure. You're bound to come across scrolls that will teach you more combos. Good luck with the exam. I'm sure you'll do great. All right. Okay, let's do the final test. Okay, it will now test you one last time. Cleanse this world and protect my companions as a blade dancer. I choose to curve blades as it will not hinder my speed or reflexes. Blade dancer, huh? Okay. Hope and eradicate evil will become a battle monk. Choose the staff for it won't break no matter. Okay, I see. Blade dancer and battle monk. Your final challenge awaits now below. Okay, I see. Tomato club. Now with faith in your abilities and purpose in your action, take leap and return as the new recruits of our order. Let's just go for it. Okay. How do I get up there? Uh, from here. Ha. Ornate stone. Ah. A 
Metal Club plus HP to ally. A weighted stone fits a brazier in Zenith Academy from the time. Okay, cookie jar. Oh, I see. She has moon rank and crescent arc. Solasty strike. Alright. Okay. Okay. What do I need to do now? Do I need to let me let me here? Ah, okay, I see. Oh wow! Fine. Now let's just do let's try this one moon moon rank nice oh i should have pressed ah oh, damn it Power bam. All right. Plus twenty, right? Let's do that. We gotta go up, huh? Let's go here. Our net stone. Fine. Nice. Ah. Ah. Nice. Nice. Ah. Nice. Nice. Let's go. Are we done? Yep. They haven't even been to the other side of the Forbidden Caravan yet. How could they understand? So you don't think we should at least try and explain? You've seen how strong they are. Weird will be. Weird will be walking apart. Let's see them off then. Oh wow! Alrighty. Weakness physical. Nice. Nice. Suffer weakness son. Ah. 
Nice. All right. Yep. Bam. Nice. Wonderful. Uh, let's wait until I get it. Nice. Nice. Okay, so next moon. Nice. Nice. So I saved that. Now it's physical. Fine. All right. So blunt. Let's do crescent moon, I guess. Level up. Congratulations, you have been trained well. Return now to your headmaster. Congratulations, Zell and Valerie. You have learned everything Zenith Academy has to teach you. In record time too, you must now learn of your ultimate power, the ability to use magic without using magic. But that knowledge is for the elder miss to impart. Come, the villagers have gathered to celebrate your departure. Okay. Where's Gal? I don't see him. Many years ago, Zell and Valerie were delivered to the, us by the great eagle. Okay. Miss Gran, all of you have come together to nurture and protect them. Okay. The good people of Ulkhir and my gaze upon the two who will soon join the ranks of Solestis Warrior. Okay, fine. This parading is ridiculous. <laughs> Oh, let the villagers have their fun, it's all they get. So you are okay with this now? You know I'm not. Now cheer with me as we send these young heroes out across the forbidden cavern to meet the elder beast. To the gate. Alright, what do we do? I want to see Gal before leaving. I guess we have to play along for now. Finger crossed that we come back later. Okay, we can come back. Fingers and toes. <laughs> All right. May Luana's might protect you. May Solon's might guide you. Metal Club. Guard Squint Flare. You just received your first two relics. Find them in the relic section of the game menu accessible with Y. Whether you prefer a lighter challenge or are looking to push yourself to the max, relics offer a range of options. There is bound to be more to find. Okay. 
Okay, merchants and valuables. All right. You must secure passage to the Wraith Iceland in the time for the next eclipse, and do keep on training. Okay. That's that's more rain for you. We weren't much older the first time. Yeah, but we'll find a way. Safe journeys and may you cleanse this world. All right. How do I get that chest? Yeah, I want to save somewhere. I mean, this is the forbidden cavern, right? Okay, I can save it here. Alright, let's wrap things up here. Uh, I will resume in the next time.